There's only one thing more than I love my wife and my kids. It's shopping at Ikea. More than your wife and kids? Now I was really debating on doing the whole like shopping through Ikea tour vlog, but at last we didn't really have the chance to do that. We were shopping around for kiddo stuff, but today, this guy, this guy right here. That's the new desk chair that we're gonna be replacing with my old one. In the last five years, also it's an Ikea one. Uh, gonna go through the process of building it today and seeing how it all looks and gonna do a couple of things to the desk to make it look nice and cool. Ooh, it's white. Alrighty, so we are on the ground here. So this is the Milbergit. It's in the white variant. Um, just because on my desk right now, I'll show you guys a little, oh, you'll see afterwards. There's black and there's white accents, so having a black and white chair I think is gonna look fairly good. Um, especially this one's a lot more comfy than the one I currently have now. Um, I think the one that I have now I spent $70 on before. This one was about $80, $89, um, $80 to $90, sorry. Um, so a little bit out of the same price, but a little more expensive, um, but definitely a lot more comfier. Um, the original Ikea chair I bought was is about five years old now, so, and the back is starting to come off. Uh, it's like starting to rip off and the zipper doesn't work on it anymore, so. I'm gonna get this guy all assembled, so throw you guys into a time-lapse mode and let's see where we go. Boom, and there we go. So the, oh God, I forgot what this thing's called. The Milbergit is done. Um, took not too long to take, uh, put together. I think it was only about 15 minutes to do. Um, really comfy, so overall. I mean, I did test it out in the store and I was pretty impressed by it. Um, having it in, inside though, feels a little more slippery than what it did at the store, um, which is okay. Um, something I didn't consider though, is that it does have a little, um, I guess a little backpack like my other chair used to have. So I know it's a little bit dark over here, but where this is breaking right here, um, I used to store a little pillow in here, so that way when I'm leaning back on it, um, it prop my back up a bit, so that way it's like a little more cushiony, I guess. But this has the same thing. And I'm actually pretty impressed with that. I didn't realize it had that. So I'm really excited to get that uh, switched over to here. So now I can kind of show you like how this is gonna look. Oh, get that out of the way. So do, 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 do. switch over the camera for you here. Okay, so that's the chair there. I'm gonna cut the tags off the bottom there just so that way it looks a little bit better. But that's the desk over there. This guy's just gonna go straight in like that, and then boom. Look at that. Such, such beauty, such wow. Drink tea, folks. Tea's good for you. All right, so I realized this video has like no storyline to it whatsoever, and that's completely okay. Um, just kind of wanted to take you guys on our journey to Ikea today, what we got, um, how to put together this uh, Milbergit, and uh, just kind of give you my first kind of initial impressions on it. Overall though, it is comfy. It does offer a lot more lumbar support than what my previous chair did, and the other one wasn't able to do this like little rocking thing. I mean, it was, but, and then somehow it just stopped working so I'm glad that I can be able to like lean back again on this so it's really good the armrests are a little bit better of a height and they're flat so they feel a lot better and also the hands 
when you're drifting down it just like this. So it feels feels a little more comfortable. Um, but yeah, like biggest gripe so far is that it does feel a little more slippery. So you, I do find myself adjusting to uh, like adjusting myself on the chair every a little more frequently, just because of the slipperiness. But um, other than that, I think it's a good purchase. Um, definitely worth needing the upgrade to something a little more a little more comfy and having a little bit of a different color. Having white is a little bit different, but I'm afraid that it's gonna get dirty really quickly, so I'm gonna have to clean it off every day pretty much. But um, thanks for watching. Um, make sure you like the video if you liked it, dislike if you disliked it, leave a comment down below. Um, if you know anything else I should get for the wonderful desk here. Um, lots of awesome. Anyway, just subscribe. I'll see you guys later.